Logical connections tell pad to pad which pins are to be connected without knowing the actual path of the trace. Logical connections will protect us from mistakes during changes. Here we go. Select nets. Create nets from traces. Confirm. OK. Now, let's move the connector below the IC and delete the traces that need rerouting. Notice the thin lines. These are the logical connection lines and tell you what needs to be connected. The logic connections will disappear if we correctly rebuild the traces. For example, let's resolve this logical connection. We would continue this way until all logical connection lines are resolved. In fact, it is recommended to create logical connections first, before even drawing the first trace of a new board. Or, you can import a net list to create logical connections. Let's draw a new logical connection to see how that works. Click the Logical Connection button. Click the pins that are to be connected. It's that simple! Logical connections also allow use of the auto router, which places traces automatically for you. Let's use the auto router to rewire the connector that we moved. Choose Tools, Route. This is the auto router dialog. We will leave all default settings as is. Click OK. All traces were placed for you in a few seconds according to the logical connections.